The ouchless bandage. That's what Curad calls itself, and it says right on the box that it's supposed to be kind to tape-sensitive skin and that wounds won't pull open when the pad is removed. Just how ouchless is it, we wondered, so we asked some ad investigators from the Children's Center in Brookline to help us find out. This is Seth Waterhouse, Yami and Mishy Baker, brother and sister, and next to them, Jeremy Simmons. Now, in front of them, we have masked three brands of bandages, Curad, Johnson & Johnson's Band-Aid, those are the two national sellers, and then we have a store brand as well. Now, we don't know which is which. Let's put them on our ad investigators and find out which hurt least. Band-Aid actually was the original brand. It appeared in 1920 or so. Curad showed up about 30 years later. Both brands say they use a standard adhesive, and both feature a cushion pad that's covered with a wick layer designed to drain the wound and absorb fluid without sticking to the scab. Actually, the pad is the reason Curad describes itself as ouchless. Without a wound, how the bandage sticks depends on where on the body you put it, how tight the skin is, how oily, how much hair is caught. Sticking also is affected by the nature of the wound and how you treat it, whether or not you wash dishes or go swimming wearing the bandage. Now, take off your bandages and remember carefully which one hurts the least. You ready? Okay, what's the verdict? Which one was ouchless, Jeremy? E. Which letter, Yami? A. 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 So A should be Curand. And that means that B is Medimart, the, the store brand. The third brand is Band-Aids. And Band-Aids and Curad, the two nationally advertised brands, when they're sold in the same store together, tend to cost just about the same price. The store brand bandages tend to cost a little bit less. And because they are also sometimes considered ouchless, as we saw from one of our investigators, they may turn out to be, from a price point of view, the most painless bandages of all. We want to thank all of our investigators very, very much. And now it's time to go to Linda Harris, who's doing something we hope doesn't require bandages at all. She's looking into how much money you might be able to save framing pictures for yourself.